4.6 billion years ago, hundreds of infant planets begin to form around the new sun. Among them, the baby Venus and Earth. And as they hurtle around the sun, collisions are inevitable. Planet formation is like a demolition derby. In a derby, the cars are racing around a track, going around in circles at different speeds. Well, it's the same thing with planets. The material is orbiting the sun. It's going around, and they're all going at different speeds, at different angles, different trajectories, and sometimes, boom. In this derby, planet hits planet. Two become one, violent. You have these large bodies that are hitting each other at really high velocity. It's really a very hot, uh, violent mess. The amount of energy released in these impacts is huge. It completely dwarfs all of the nuclear weapons on Earth combined. And yet, somehow, on these scales, you wind up forming gigantic objects that we call planets. Earth and Venus become voracious planet eaters. But two spectacular collisions set the twins on very different paths. That was the moment Venus and Earth went through this divergence to what has now become these really dramatically different worlds. The divergence begins when a Mars-sized object hits Earth. The impact makes our planet spin faster. The core spins with it, generating a powerful magnetic field around the planet. The field fends off the worst of the sun's radiation. Around the same time, Venus takes a head-on hit from another infant planet. This impact explains something very weird about Venus. Venus is actually rotating in the wrong direction. How could that be? Well, what if it got hit really hard by some object? That could do it. An object so huge, Venus stops in its tracks and begins to spin backwards. If you think about how much energy and what size you need to change a planet's spin, that is an incredibly large hit. But the backspin is slow, 243 times slower than Earth. Without a fast spin, Venus's core can't generate a strong magnetic field. It has no protection from the deadly stream of particles blasted from the sun. Venus does not have a strong magnetic field, and so it has suffered the full brunt of this wind blasted out from the sun. The tail of two planets now splits radically. Venus will roast under a violent, suffocating atmosphere. Earth will give birth to oceans, life, and intelligence. But ultimately, these twins' fates are the same. Earth's future is Venus. Pure hell. <laughs>